Did you see Elemental? Thank you for reminding me. I wanted to bring this up. This, this is one of the biggest turnarounds in box office history. Somehow, Elemental just out-earned Spider-Man. Across the Spider-Verse, that is. This thing was a complete flop, initially. I even made a whole video about their desperate Hail Mary marketing strategy with Claude. Where they did like the POV of Claude. Audience reaction when Claude comes on screen. It's like stocks, like cheers, like, wee Claude! It was flopping. Flopping in the biggest possible way. And yet, it is now over 445 million. And is now beating across the Spider-Verse. From fucking nowhere. Welcome, Striker. Thanks, Kevin. We're the aliens sim game. Maybe. This is a lie? You think? I don't know. May it, it's, it's illegal to fudge your box office numbers, but it is Disney. They can get away with anything. But it was such a big, colossal flop when it debuted and even for like the first two weeks two or three weeks and now out of nowhere it's just popping off how it's not like i've seen people talking about elemental or anything so where's it coming from it'll go up later arrow welcome silent hey fuck yeah floyd looking looking forward to seeing you there then The, the Claude marketing worked. That's what I'm saying. The Claude marketing somehow got it done. I don't really get it, but... Claude the Boy Wonder does it again. Yeah, Phasmophobia was very good. I enjoyed it. Don't think I'd go back to it, though. It was internationally? Well, even still, though. That's a crazy international run from out of nowhere. But South Korea went crazy, apparently. There has to be money laundering in the box office for Elemental? I don't know. The older we get, the less hype new Disney Pixar films have. No, I think it's just them kind of phoning it in. I don't think that's the case. I think Pixar is just kind of going through the motions in recent years. Oh, I forgot the Haunted Mansion movie came out. That one flopped. That one flatlined. Claude gonna get his own Minion style spinoff in two years? That'd be disastrous. Final Fantasy 16 is good. Not game of the year, but good. Thanks, Sadako. And welcome, Cat. Soul was good. I enjoyed Soul. Welcome, Jordan. That was thank that was wholesome. Thank you, Sadie. Have a good night. The line is tech tip drama goes really deep. I couldn't sum it up concisely for you. I'd say watch the Gamer Nexus videos on it and then the uh, the statements from some former employees. There's a lot to it. I'm redecorating the room. So I moved it. Will Smith died and Jada claims from food poisoning. Are you just living in some kind of alternate dimension? What are you talking about? Will Smith didn't just die. That'd be huge news. I, I would know. Unless you're at his house right now. Like, what do you mean? <laughs> well, I watch Peter 5 8. What is, what is that? Is that like a Ligma thing? Is that, is that about to lead up to a punchline? Welcome, Z. 
and Drew and Gallon. Thanks, Invader. Appreciate the 10, Raphael. Have you ever watched Monster? The anime? Yes. I did. I watched that in college. I even remember there was talk of a Monster live action for Netflix, which I think probably could have went hard, but they dropped it. Will Smith did not die. I even I, I even went through the effort of looking it up. He is not dead. His career is after the slap, but he is very much still alive. Much to the dismay of Jada's boyfriend, I imagine. Did you play Amnesia Bunker? I speed ran Amnesia Bunker. I did not actually play it normally, though. <laughs> Sorry to say. Yeah, I watched the Defunct Land video on Epcot. Defunct Land makes incredible work. And thank you, the Big 50 pimp. Appreciate that, man. And hello, Cyan. Peter 5-8 is the Kevin Spacey movie. Oh, that's right! I forgot I forgot about this. Oh shit, yeah, it's this it's this awful looking movie. Where's the trailer? Why is it not coming up? Yeah, 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 yeah. The not garbage version. No such thing. Where, did they take down the original trailer? <laughs> Man. I think it was beautifully disastrous. Appreciate it, Gus. Thank you, man. And deep. Have you seen Imminence in Shadow? It's a good cringe anime. Never heard of it. And I've never watched Peaky Blinders either. I know, I made a whole video on this, but the uh, original trailer's not here anymore. Which is crazy. It's a great trailer. Not, not like genuinely, but it's a fun one. Very silly.